Okay, this how-to video is going to show you how to use the place search providers uh, functionality that's been added at uh, Orca Capture 17.4. So this is actually um, allowing you to access online resources for schematic symbols, PCB footprints and uh, 3D step models if they're available. Um, and it's using the online resources of either Ultra Librarian or Symexis. So um, let's actually just uh, show you the command. So we'll go to place and search providers. This is then uh, launches a new window with the search providers functionality. Um, it will usually ask you for a login, so I'll just show you that. So we'll, I'll go and configure the providers. I've already logged in here, but it utilizes effectively your, your Cadence COS support account um, to access. And then I've also got access using the Ultra Librarian website, so um, you can log into the Ultra Librarian website, uh, register for free, um, and then that will give you access to the Ultra Librarian data as well. So once I'm logged in and authenticated, it will then start to search either the Symexis or Ultra Librarian options. And I can just see a list of, of parts here. I can actually come up here and, and type for a specific parts. So if I was going to look for an AD9850, for example, let's just go and search for one of those. I've got a few results coming from, from DigiKey, so it's actually giving me some of the distributor information as well. So um, let's just go and click one of these parts, double click it to select the part. It's got the, the, the preview of a PCB footprint, the preview of a schematic symbol, and some property information that's going to bring that down. Um, so it'll then go and download all that information, and then the part will be attached to my mouse ready to place. So there's the part attached. I'll just put a couple down to make a, some connectivity, and then we can uh, we can look at it. So if I double click and look at the, the properties of the part, you can see it's actually brought in some, some categories. I've got a description category, I've got a distributor and distributor part number, manufacturer, manufacturer part number, some temperatures, some package sizes, PCB footprints, etc. If we select the part, we can do a right click and show footprint, and it's actually downloaded the footprint for me. Um, so let's just save the design, and then what we'll do is we'll actually uh, let's just run design sync. So we'll take it into PCB and we'll synchronize this. open with an all-cap professional license and there's my two ICs so before we do that let's just do a, a design very very quickly let's just do uh, set an origin point let's just go and draw a board outline um, to our options pane so and place our two ICs and if we have a quick look at the 3D view we actually get the step model brought in as well so it's bringing in the full uh, scenario for this part so I've got the schematic symbol the PCB footprint and the 3D step model.